adding fractions with different denominators, 3 fourths plus 1 sixth. First, we're going to rearrange the numbers so it's easier to keep track of things. Write the problem vertically, up and down, just like we would if we're adding regular numbers. There we go. Second, find the common denominator and write it down for both add ends and the sum. There it is. We're going to change how we write the number, but it still means the same thing. Twelfths are a lot smaller than fourths or sixths, so I will need more pieces for it to be the same amount. The same amount is shaded. It would be tedious to draw out the fractions and count to get the new numerator and add the pieces, so let's use math. What do you have to multiply the denominator by to get the new denominator? Write it down, then write the same thing above it. We are multiplying by 3 thirds and 2 halves, which are both different ways of saying 1. Multiplying by 1 doesn't change the value. Now we're adding 9 twelfths and 2 twelfths, and we can do that because they're the same size unit. Add the numerators. Reduce if you can, but we can't. Let's go through the steps again. First, write the problem vertically, then find a common denominator, put that in all three places. Then figure out what to multiply by to get the new denominators, and multiply the numerator by that too to get the new numerators. Add the numerators, keep the denominator, simplify if you can. That's it. The legal stuff.